I just watched a movie, got directions to my destination here, texted my dad, and balanced my checkbook, all on my smartphone. Now, I really don't have a clue how that works, but fortunately, I know some people who do. Oh, hey, Doc. Oh, Dave! Put your phone on the light and put the goggles and vest on! Oh, my new particle shrinking reductionizer only has enough power for 60 seconds! Here we go! Whoa. We're actually inside of my smartphone. These are microprocessors and circuit boards. Why, just 20 years ago, the amount of electronics needed to power your current phone would have filled an entire room. Dave, look! Over here! A microphone! Stereo sound system with compact speakers! Testing, one, two, three. Dave, come on! Okay. Is that my thumbprint? That's the keyboard, integrated into the interface. This smartphone uses capacitive technology. Marconi and Bell would be doing backflips if they saw this. I never knew that... Oh, Doc, what is that? This is a high-speed portal to virtually all human knowledge on the Internet. This smartphone uses digital technology that converts the Internet, video games, movies, your voice, into binary digits zero and one. It all fits in the palm of your hand. Whoa, Doc. Something's happening. Great, Scott! We're running out of time! Hold on, Dave! Oh, thanks a lot, Doc. That's a lot of help. Oh, no! I forgot! What is it, Doc? Did we generate too much electricity and overload the flux capacitor? No! Worse! I burnt my toast again! Oh, I need another loaf of bread! We're almost up, Dave. Come on. It's a great signal. Wow. Oh, the view up here is incredible. So this is, uh... This is the cell tower. That's right, Dave. A tower like this might give you phone coverage for a few city blocks, or up to 250 square miles, depending on location. <laughs> Always spit out the wings. Cell phone companies often co-locate their antennas onto the same tower, because modern antennas are pretty small, and they can be mounted onto flagpoles on top of buildings or hidden in trees. <laughs> so it looks like a tree. Huh, I didn't think of that. I'm gonna go see a friend who's gonna explain to me what makes my phone mobile. Are you sure you're gonna be all right out here? Oh, I think I'll survive, Dave. I've got a limo coming to take me back to the penthouse. Man, that's wild. When you turn your wireless device on, it performs a number of activities via the wireless network, even before you can say, Hello, Dave. Hey, Lieutenant. How's the case coming? I'll ask the questions, Dave. What makes your device mobile? Because I can pick it up and walk around with it? Uh-huh. That's funny, Dave. But the reason you can walk around with it is because your network senses when your signal is weak and automatically hands it off to another antenna with a stronger signal. What do you know about dead spots, Dave? Where did they come from? Hey, that spot was alive when I left it. We're talking about physics here, Dave. Obstructions. Wireless is good, but it has to work with Mother Nature. Trees, hills and valleys, bad weather and tall buildings. I hope you're paying attention, Dave. Oh, yeah, 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 I am. It's amazing. All of those zeros and ones flying through the air, hitting the right tower, shooting through the network, and it all comes out here, perfectly, no matter where I am. All I can say is, wow. Wow is only the half of it. 
So, to keep us connected, wireless relies on assigned radio wave frequencies to send signals. This is called spectrum. Unfortunately, smartphone use is growing so fast, we need more spectrum to keep up with demand. Yay! Oh, Doc, what are you doing here? I'm back from the future. Because of the lack of spectrum, networks are clogged, traffic is slow, and people are beginning to explore other options. Wow, I'm here to work on the issue and change the course of the future. Hello, Dave. You can position antennas all over the place. But without more spectrum, it's an uphill battle. Punch it, Fuzzy. So if we want the magic to keep on happening with these amazing devices, the government will need to free up more spectrum for wireless soon. I guess this case is closed.